start this match in three, two, one, go. First 15 seconds of autonomous robot action. Even some human players getting in there. Swing but a miss. And Red Alliance starts off strong with three robots backing out of the tarmac and making one up high in the upper hub. They'll take away an eight point lead as we start the tele-operated period. 41-12 fighting back, but the cargo just bounces out. As two red robots cross the center line and go over to the blue side of the field. Hyperion playing defense for red and it's working as Techno Titans has free reign to score in the upper hub. Meanwhile, in the blue hangar, 60-23 disc bots already hanging from the mid rung with 100 seconds to go. Two pieces of cargo up and in for both the Red and Blue Alliance. As Blue Alliance looks to close the gap as Red leads 24 to 6. Here comes team 1683 lining up on the red tarmac. 45-16 defending their position. And Red Alliance scores two in the upper hub with one minute to go. Coming back to the red side of the field, two blue robots and three red. Lots of commotion here on the red tarmac. Coming back to score, 33-29, gets one in the lower hub. But Techno Titans are ready to answer as one makes it into the upper hub for red. You know what that sound means, 30 seconds left. As teams head back towards the hangar, 35-81, think robotics already lining up to ascend and hang from the lower rung. Their alliance partners aiming higher and 1683 firmly pulls up, but one hook doesn't hold on the mid rung. Five seconds now, three, two, one. Your final score for qualification 38, the Red Alliance wins with a score of 32 to 26. Blue Alliance still taking away that hangar ranking point as they had 16 points.